What is up, everyone? Hope you're having a great Wednesday. Welcome to Searching for Hits with Eric. I am Eric. And wanted to show off my new logo, courtesy of my daughter. This is going to be digitized and hopefully used in a digital ver form soon. But for now, we'll use it as a backdrop for the show. And for this video, we're going to be opening up some 2020 product. Uh, I also was able to pick up in a local card shop some random packs from late 80s, early 90s that I'll be opening up tomorrow for a throwback Thursday video. For this, we got a value pack of 2020 Chrome, which I'm real excited to get into. Also have a blaster of 2020 Optic and a jumbo pack of 2020 Update, which you could still find uh, randomly in different locations. So we will start with the 2020 Update, looking for all your 2020 rookies, um, maybe catch uh, lightning in a bottle, get an autograph or a relic. Um, also looking for a potential numbered card. So we'll, uh, we'll see what we get. Um, after this, we'll open up the optic and then finish off with the tops chrome, which I am most excited to get into. And then tomorrow we have an assortment of packs, including a uh, 1993 Top Series 1. We got a couple of packs of Series 1 and 2 from 94 Tops. Uh, we have, uh, what else do we have? A jumbo pack from 88 Fleer, a jumbo pack from uh, 89 Tops, I believe. So all kinds of interesting stuff. But leading this pack off, we got a rookie card of Philip Deal. We got uh, Scott Barlow. Just fly through these. We've opened up update before. Uh, McGuire, Greinke, Alex Verdugo, Davis. Looking for, I'd love to find an Arizarena. I'd love to find something of a, of a parallel or some sort of a hit. Uh, we got Sean Poppin. We got our sleeves and a couple of uh, top loaders standing by in case we do come across any big hits. We'll put them up on the screen. Uh, we got uh, Sean Poppin. Fuller. Oh, there's a Beau Bichette. We'll, uh, we'll get that sleeved up after we finish this run. Jesus Aguilar. Bregman. We got a foil. Uh, it's a rainbow foil of Moustakis. So we'll put that in a sleeve as well and get those up on the screen in a minute. We have an insert. That's the uh, uh, numbers game. Andrew Jones. Uh, not Andrew Jones, Chipper Jones, excuse me. Um, nice insert card, not numbered or anything like that. Uh, we have a, a Yamaguchi rookie card, Mookie Betts, Greg Garcia. We got a Trout, Petit, another Trout. Trout's got about four or five cards in this set. Uh, Nolan Arenado, Shaquin, McGuire from the Home Run Derby, Luis Severino. I actually pulled his uh, autograph from another pack. And there's Jose Martinez, who, if I'm not mistaken, is a few cards ahead of Arizarena if the coalition is still the same. McCutcheon, Pujols, and I am wrong as we finish off with a Grayson Grenier. So not too, too bad. We'll get that, uh, that Beau Bichette and that Moustakis foil sleeved up real quick. Protect those two cards. That Beau Bichette's worth a few dollars. We'll put that right there. And uh, Moustakis, rainbow foil, eh, maybe a dollar or two. Nothing too, too crazy. But still, good start. And out of just a jumbo pack, we'll, uh, we'll take it. So onward, we're going to save that Topps Chrome for last. And we're going to get into this 2020 Optics uh, blaster box, which is pretty cool. Going to be looking for... Parallels, there's going to be a Blaster exclusive pink parallel pack of three cards. Um, there's your odds and such, or uh, that's actually the, uh, where are the odds? Uh, we'll find the odds inside, but uh, let's open it up. I know there's all kinds of different colored parallels, virtually a rainbow of parallels. There's on-card autographs in this set, in this uh, product. So hopefully we'll find some good stuff. Still looking for the good rookies. I'll throw that off to the side. There's our optic bonus pack with those pink parallels. And one, two, three, four, five, and six. So let's get opening. 
We'll save the parallel pack for the end here, and then we'll get into those chrome cards, which I am excited about. So Panini Optic, um, I opened this once before. Um, nice cards, like them a lot. Uh, good uh, variation of numbers. Um, leading it off is a Trent Grisham. We'll get that sleeved up. That's certainly one of the top rookies. Um, Logan Allen. Um, we'll leave that Trent Grisham on screen for now, and then we'll get it sleeved up. We got a uh, refractor throwback of Daryl Strawberry. Very nice. I don't believe that's numbered. Nope, not numbered. Uh, throwback to the 86, uh, 86 style, but um, that's the optic right there. Um, and a Fernando Tatis Jr. This is what the back of the cards look like. You get your career stats along with the previous year. Um, pretty complete stats along with a little snippet of who they are. But um, real nice. We'll get, uh, let me get that Grisham and that Strawberry in a sleeve. Get those up on the screen. And then we'll get into the next pack. Hope everyone's having a great Wednesday. Really looking forward to tomorrow's video where we'll be cracking into some old packs from when I was collecting the first time, taking a look at some uh, some late 80s, early 90s cards. Let's see what we could find in the second pack of Optic here. Okay, leading things off is going to be uh, Isan Diaz, rated rookie, not too bad. We got a Javi Baez, Diamond King, and we got a mythical Ronald Acuna Jr., pretty cool right there, uh, along with a Freddie Freeman. Those mythicals are not numbered, but uh, nice looking insert card. Certainly take that. Okay, next pack up. Love to find an autograph, particularly Luis Robert or uh, really any of the major ones. Alvarez, Lux. Dylan Cease is a nice one. We'll take that. Dylan Cease is going to be a, a good one, I believe. Uh, TJ Zook. We'll put Cease up on screen. We'll get that sleeved up. Uh, TJ Zook. We got a, an Illusions card of Mookie Betts and a Shane Bieber. So, not too bad. We'll put that Dylan Cease in a sleeve. I like that card a lot as well. Okay, hopefully we'll get some, some home runs here. Love to get a big time hit from this. Get into this next pack. Leading things off is a Bryce Harper Diamond King card. We have a rated rookie card of Danny Mendick. A uh, Ricky Henderson and Jack Flaherty. So nothing too exciting in that one. But um, got two packs left plus that bonus pack, which is going to be going to be nice. Those are going to be those optic pink parallels. If I get this pack open. There we go. An Aaron Nola on the back. Flip that around. Got a Brian Abreu leading it off, followed by Marcus Simeon. We got a refractor of, who is that? It's Trey Mancini. It's not numbered, just a rainbow refractor prism card. Nice though, nice prism. We'll put that up on screen. And there is the Aaron Nala. So, Make sure you hit that subscribe button and like the video, We're trying to grow the channel. Uh, leave a comment, let me know what your favorite card is or if I happen to miss anything really special. Let's see what this card is. There's an all-star of Javi Baez. We got a Sean Murphy rated rookie, followed by a nice Joe Adele rookie card and an Ozzy Albee. So nice pack, we'll put that Adele up on screen. That's a nice card. We'll certainly take that. Sean Murphy, not as high on Sean Murphy, but uh, still love getting the rookie cards. So that does it for our base packs in the Optic Blaster Box. Now let's see what this 2020 Optic Bonus Pack has. Love to get a pink parallel of Robert. 
or Alvarez. Um, I know that there's some autos in here, which would be amazing. So up first, we have a Charlie Blackman, followed by JV, Justin Verlander, and a pink parallel Diamond King of Javi Baez. So nice looking prism cards, uh, pink prism parallels. Um, certainly worth, uh, you know, more than the base. Um, out of those, nothing too, too exciting, but, um, you know, pink parallels, certainly cool. We'll put those up on screen. And now we get to the one that I was looking forward to, or at least looking forward to the most. Um, that's this jumbo pack of Topps Chrome. So let's, uh, let's get on into this value, pa value pack, excuse me. Cut that top off. Make sure we don't rip anything. Inside of the value pack is four additional or set of four smaller packs, three base packs and a bonus pink refractor pack. So we'll open that last. Um, decent shot at, uh, at autos and parallel cards. So we'll see if we get lucky and find anything really cool in these. Love Topps Chrome, great product. Um, like it a little better than Bowman Chrome, but uh, both really, really nice products. So we got Oscar Mercado. We got Junior Fernandez rookie card. Rafael Iglesias. And wow, what is that? We got a nice Gavin Lux refractor card. That is going to definitely be the best card so far um not sure exactly what that goes for on ebay but um gavin lux is going to be a good one and a rainbow refractor tops chrome is certainly a great card to have so <clears throat> we'll put that right in the center of the screen let's see what else we can pull from this pack number two got brian reynolds gold cup card on top Followed by JV, Justin Verlander. We got a Sean, uh, Sam Hilliard, excuse me, rookie card. And a nice Juan Soto, 85 tops style design. Nice refractor, 85 throwback card. Uh, like that card a lot too. So, got a couple of very nice cards so far. Going into pack number three. Brandon Belt on the back. We got Glaber Torres on the front, followed by Mike Yastrzemski and Michael Fulmer. And the Brandon Belt is actually a refractor. Um, that's just a regular refractor. I don't know if the Gavin Lux. It's not numbered, but like that a lot. So that is the base packs and Topps Chrome. And then let's get into the Topps Chrome bonus pack of pink refractors. Would love to find one of the big rookies in this pack. Got the spacer in the back. Get that off. First card is going to be a Chris Bryant. I uh, believe I forgot to show you what these cards look like. There's an Aaron Judge. The back is your standard Topps design with all their stats. Uh, really like the Topps design every year. Um, nice cards. Uh, so there's an Aaron Judge. We got a Corey Seager. Got a Joey Votto. And Low Kane, Lorenzo Kane. So... Didn't get any of the top ones that I was looking for, but nice cards nonetheless. That's what the back of them look like. Um, really nice cards. So let me know what you think, what you feel is the best card that I pulled. Um, I'm leaning towards that Gavin Lux right there. Uh, but uh, hit that like and subscribe button. Make sure to join me again. I'm going to upload another video tomorrow afternoon. Uh, that will be our throwback Thursday looking at some 
80s and 90s cards. Thank you very much, and thanks again to my daughter for designing our new logo, Veronica, with the great digital designing of the Searching for Hits logo. Thank you, everybody. Have a good rest of your day.